everyone, this is Melissa Arma with the Stock Swoosh, and I thought I would do an options review of the calls I've made here, just, just in the last two weeks, actually, uh, because there's been some really, really nice, nice moves in stocks. I mean, I'm just seeing them and calling them, and when the opportunity arises in the market, you got to take it, and there's been just huge opportunity here with the bullish momentum in the market in the last two weeks, three weeks. So I called, the first one here was Netflix that I called. It ended up being a huge home run. I called it for the breakout. I actually called the trade in here on the 17th. And I called it out. And it was to buy Netflix 150 calls. I had it out for three weeks. Bottom line was it gapped up here then on the 25th and ran up through the strike. Huge trade. Ran up three and a half points of strike. This was a really good exit here. And if you were able to hold it into here, it was even better, okay? It was out to the end of last week. Beautiful trade, ran up almost eight points through the strike. That was a great, great call. Huge call in Netflix. Then I called Google. Google had the earnings at the end of the month. This was in April. And then I ended up calling the 920 calls here on 5-2. The stock ran up over the strike this day. Ran up, actually ran up. It's just, it's, it's just incredible here, okay? This, I, I called this here with a 920 strike to buy this day. It ran up here within two days, within 48 hours, 15 points plus, through the strike, you're in the money everything through the strike, for those of you that don't know options, okay? Whether you got out here or here, it was a huge, huge, huge trade. Then I called the, no, the next one was Apple. Next one was Apple that I called. That was the massive, huge trade. I called this here on this day, Friday morning. I called the 148 strike into the morning, into the open on Apple. Ran up, opened at 146.76, ran up through the strike on this day, popped up on Monday. This was absolutely crazy. Almost $6 through the strike within 48 hours. Once again, push up. The huge momentum move up. I'm calling these and they're going right into the money, right through the strike, right in. Within one to two business days, I'm calling these stocks and they're running up huge. I'm like seeing them before they make the move and how am I able to do it in the stock in the gap, reading the price, reading the institutional buying that's coming in. I'm seeing it before it comes in. That's what is so, it's, it's incredible. It's incredible. Google then was the next one here. No, 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 no. Amazon, I'm sorry. No, IBM, I forgot. I forgot because this is actually not a call. I called a put in this. I called this on Friday too. After the stock gapped down, but rally, but ready to go to the day to short, but didn't fall through the short in the live day, I called the 155 puts on this day. It gapped down Monday morning, once again through the strike. You would have bought a put on this. It opened at 152.80. It opened more than $2 through the strike on this day. This is out for several weeks as well. It's through the strike. You could have got out of it yesterday, could have got out of it today. Target on this next target is 150. This is showing huge weakness against the bullish market. One solid red bar down, and this will be an exit on this. This is a beautiful call. Again, it closed today 152. Strike was 155. This is $3 in the money. And there's plenty of time left. The next one was Amazon. That one I called yesterday on a bullish gap up. I called the 950 calls. It ran up into 949 last night and gapped up this morning and opened almost $3 into the money today. 952.80 and ran up almost eight bucks. 957.89 was a high today on Amazon. <laughs> Once again, that ran up. And I also called this morning before the open, BABA, 120 calls to buy, ran up into the strike, immediately into the money today, huge and should follow through. I gave time out on this as well, but the earnings are on the 18th, so you got to you had to get out of this today, or you had to get out of it in the next couple of days. But another one that just ran, you just took the trade and you went right positive. Many, 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 many trades that I take go immediately positive, which is one of the huge benefits of trading with me. If a stock stops out, 
then it stops you out and you're out the loss quick. Most of the trades though that I call or do are winners and they go immediately positive. So whether you get out of it right away or hold it for a bigger move is up to you. And that has to do with your own money management. So that was one, two, three, four, five, six. Five bullish moves, one short move, which was the put, six huge winners and huge calls I've made in the last two weeks in these in, in these trades that I reviewed here in the options. These are just options. This isn't even counting the day trades in the daily trading room. Because obviously I haven't called an option trade every day. But when I see a good one, when I see a good gap, when I see a gap that rates per the 26 point golden gap rating system, I call it, everybody that is on the options letter, or if you have done the class and you know how to rate the gaps, you can take them yourself. So it's up to you to decide if you want to learn the system and make the trades yourself and take the trades yourself, which you can do after my class, or you sign up for the options letter and you decide to do the trades just to get them emailed to you and you take the trades. I mean, I'm on fire lately. Every day I have to get up and say to myself, be focused, be focused, focus, 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 focus. So I'm fully aware of the fact that, uh, you know, I'm on fire. And I think that there's something to do with the fact that I've been trading now for a long time. I've been trading now for almost nine years. And I've been trading nothing but gaps. And it's a system I created myself. And I do think that that has something to do with it. The longer that I trade, the more successful I am. The more money I'm making and the better the calls I'm seeing and the less losers I'm calling or doing or seeing and the more winners and the and, and, and the bigger winners that I'm pinpointing. It has to do with predicting the move the stock's gonna make in the gap. Whether you do a swing trade, an option trade, or a day trade, it doesn't matter. I do have to stay focused. I will stay within myself to do that for myself and for the clients that I have that are ready with me. But the one thing is for certain, if you wanna learn how to make money trading, then you could do my class and learn from me. There's no two ways about it. And uh, I think the most important people that I have them behind me and on my side are my students, the people that have done the class, that are in the room, that are on the option letter, that are taking the trades and they're seeing the profits themselves and they're, and, and they're making the money. So congratulations to everyone that's been doing the calls and I will see you all soon. If you're interested in more information on the next Golden Gap class, it's May 20th and 21st. If you want to sign up for the options letter, you can do that. You just get the trades emailed to you. Uh, you can email me for that as well. Thanks everyone, have a great night.